Hi, my name is Bruce Doran. I'm one of the staff scientists at Science North, and I want to talk about a situation that happens to all of us. You know, you're ready to go outside, it's nice and cold. You get outside, and the next thing you know, you have to go pee, you have to go urinate, okay? And this is probably a situation that happens to all of us at some point. And I get questioned, why does that happen? Well, why? happens when you send your body out in the cold, when it's cold outside, you have a normal reaction where the blood vessels at the extremities of your body start to contract, start to restrict blood in order to keep the blood closer to the main part of your body. And that's a normal reaction in order to keep the blood here and also the heat of the blood to protect your organs and also your brain. So it's a complete normal reaction. But when you have that constriction of the blood, what happens is that your blood pressure starts to go up and your body doesn't want that. It wants to maintain the blood pressure at the same. So another organ starts to work, starts to kick in. And I have an example right here, a model, and the kidneys, the kidneys are right here. Those organs are actually involved in maintaining your blood pressure. So when your blood pressure goes up, what the kidney does, it removes excess or water that's in your blood in the form of urine, all right? So by doing that, by removing some of the water that's in your blood, your blood pressure then goes back down, but the side effect is you need to go pee. So if you don't want that to happen every time you go out, you know, for a walk or, you know, somewhere else, all you need to do is you need to dress warm, making sure that you cover your head, your body, and also your extremities. So simple reason why you need to go pee, it's your body's response to the cold. So hopefully that will answer your question, why do I need to go pee when it's cold?